going to get a shot of you passing, Mum. Oh, hi. Hi. <laughs> Where are you off to? Um, I'm not sure. <laughs> Come on then. I'm going to see you oh, to the good. gate. Oh, good. Come on then. Go on then. Uh, Do you feel like Bilbo Baggins? I feel like... We're going on an adventure! Yeah. You're moving with great aplomb. Am I? Yeah, you kind of pace. It's in a straight line. Straight line, and it's quite cool. Yeah. And it's kind of about to be downhill. Come on, you can do it. It's just crossing that road you've got to be careful about, Mum. It's hot when you get out there, isn't it? Well, what are you going to do when you get down there? I've got my reading book and I've got my drawing book. Oh, Mum, this is cute. Now, if you carry on round to the left, you get into St. Ives. I know all of that, but I, I'm not, you're not, I'm not striving for... Perfection. Um, you're going for excellence. What's, what's the phrase? Glass palaces instead of elephants? No, I don't know what the phrase yeah, is. Don't, don't strive for, I think it is. I think the exact yeah. saying is, don't strive for glass palaces, just settle for elephants. I think that is the saying. Yeah, okay. So um, that, ah. You'll be all right. No. Be careful. Oh, oh. If you can't be careful, be kind. Remember, Mum, better to be kind than right. How long do you think it could be before we not go out? Uh, probably at least half an hour. You might be back before we've gone. Yeah. Just see how you get on. Okay. And Mum, yeah. don't forget. No, I won't forget. Well, it's like watching Paddington Bear set off on an adventure. I have to speed it up a bit. Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, give us a... Say, say, bye, subs. Subs, I might be sometime. Can you see? Not really. <laughs> I put, I put these on, I can't. You feel a bit encumbered. Look. Oh. You just poked your eye out. Oh, Mum. Oh, God, it's all going wrong already. <laughs> all right. Do you think somebody will feel sorry for me? I'll send out a rescue party in about 10 minutes. I know, Kiki literally looked disturbed then. Yeah, yeah it I is did. worrying you're heading off in the... I mean, you go you go around London on your own all the time. That's London. That's true. Um, Careful, watch out for the crabs. Rear left. Is that on the right side, Mum? <laughs> Rear left. Don't worry, Subs. I'm going to be following her closely behind, making sure she's okay. I'll be checking up on her as soon as I've sorted this lot out. taking back swimming pools. What, the re revolutionary? Yeah, revolution, yeah, the revolution, the revolution. The French revolution pool. on the swimming pool. People come home and just finding strangers in their swimming pool. Piscine. Um, so it is illegal, obviously, if you're in someone's house, but the police just aren't responding to it. The police aren't so responding to anything. back and there's people like sat having drinks and stuff. But then a lot of the big apartment blocks have swimming pools. And because they're technically public land, there's nothing legally they can do in France. Oh. People just overtake the swimming pool. How bizarre. Look. Totally deserted trains. Day of the train strike. So we're, we're kind of following our noses, but the girls have stopped. Man, it's the bridge. Oh, this is so See? cool. And oh, there's the beach. beach. It's the beach. This is a local's way around this Isn't it? There's toilets. There's crazy golf. Oh, look, here we go. Look, it's like a jungle. I can't see nothing. Oh, there's the beach. Whoa. You don't get beaches like this in the UK. Look at that. Jesus, look at these. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Mini golf fun for family. Right. I love mini golf. Look, it's barren. This is fun for that does not look fun. Here we are. Sandy beach. Sandy, 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 sandy. No crabs. Nanny Dye is over there somewhere. I'm quite impressed. Nanny Dye just phoned me on the phone, guys. You're going to be impressed by this. She said, do I carry on round to St. Ives? I know what's going to happen today. Nanny Dye is going to have seen all this great art and I'm not going to have done it. I'm going to be really annoyed and frustrated, but no, I'll be really pleased for her. But look at this. Look at this. Look. Everything you want, including her. Ah. So you think, why did you go to bloody Greece? Uh, well, I said exactly that up there yesterday. Well, we didn't know it was going to be. No, we when didn't. We, to Greece, we didn't know we were no, going to have we the we were gonna have. Away. We thought we were going to. 
And we also thought we were going to at least find a grain of sand. Yeah. This is just incredible, isn't it? Isn't it this beach? Well, you know what? For years I've looked at this beach because whenever I've come to St. Ives, I've never been interested in beach holidays before, Nads. And then I've always looked at this and sort of seen this beach and never thought, never ever come here. And this is it. We're on it. What was this beach called? Can't remember. Porth Gidden or something? No, we didn't know that. Porth something like that. Because they're wet. <laughs> they've been wet since Greece. No, 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 they haven't. No, I just walked through a stream on the beach. And they're wet. <laughs> and it's annoying though, isn't it? It's like I've got wellies on. Da 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 da. Bab's Hex, as I call her. Love that. That would have been great. You would have been filming that as I got struck. I'd have been filming Bab's Hex. Bab's Hex. <laughs> Babs Pex. Babs Heps. Babs Heps. Right, where are we going? Coffee shop. Yeah. Wow, guys, look at that. For a lemon meringue pie. How did they cut it? What did you get? And the chocolate cake. The almond slice. Hang on, have you missed the chocolate cake? The coffee and walnut. Your mum loves coffee and walnut. Wow, that's the best cherry chocolate brown. The makers of these. Cherry chocolate brown. Let's see, let's look in this one. Going fast. Oh, look at that. Cheese and all the these look so good. Right, what we have to do each morning is get coffee, come here and get a, get a daily pastries. If you get them for lunch, yeah. mind you, we had a pasta yesterday, mind you, I don't mind having a pasta every day. I just do this thing, whenever I come to Cornwall, I just accept that I'm going to go home seven to eight pounds heavier than when I've arrived. It's never been any different, okay. and I'm just going to hand it over. I love pasties. I never have a pasty in London. We come to Cornwall once a year, we're going to have pasties again for lunch. It's the moon end of Zena. I like the look of the coffee shop. Oh, oh, this is where I wanted going? to come, yeah. Oh, nice. I have found your dream, and it's not a woman. It's a rambling, rambling jack. jack. I the I suppose it's if you're rambling. Yeah, walking. You take it, Stuff and it will. Pocket. Sorry. It's delicious. Look at this seedy flapjack. Mm -hmm. <sighs> oh, God, is that a blueberry oh, lemon drizzle cake? It is. There, so it's a blueberry. And look at this one. Mm. <laughs> Where's my pistache? No, I think that and that. Oh, another lumberjack. Look at that cinnamon bun. Oh, nice. Kiki That's Kiki's favourite as well. Gazillion. Yeah. Oh, I like that. Okay, he sits down with a happy wake with coffee and his lumberjack. Massive one. This is such a cute. This is such a cute coffee shop. Can you get the name of it for people? Yeah, no, not for me. Moo made. Moo made. Moo made. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I'm just. Yes. Try to try to check it. I'm just removing that from under there. Hey. Why do they put cakes on top of napkins? I don't know. So, so Somebody's going to have an answer to that. Really. Well, weird. Hang on, you're testing my. Yeah, because I want to make sure it's not poison. Come on. <laughs> Yeah. 
between fishing and the two. I feel like a local. I mean, I know I'm not obviously Cornish people, but I, mean, I wish I was. Oh, I desperately want to go back to Zena. I want to go to Zena because, of course, I wrote like that pub. and I wrote that script about the one yeah. the smallest AA meeting in the world. How far is it from here? Ten minute drive. Oh, well, let's go. We can go tonight if you want. We've come back. We thought, what are we doing not going in and buying half the shop? <laughs> Better to give business to local business exactly. people than point this overpriced restaurant. I want to try not to go to, to the supermarket as well. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They're trying on it, you know, that's real. Look at that guy doing those sausage roll with the red onion and rosemary. Uh, no, okay. So we're getting cheese. So what? The large and medium look the same size, don't they? We'll meet in it. We've got three meat and three cheese. cheese. Oh, you're getting any cake? Tomorrow. Have you seen that fruit cake? Have tomorrow. you seen the raisin yeah, cake? I have, I know. Do you want some? No, I'll no, tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow. Yeah, just say tomorrow. <laughs> Wow. Well, there's a half a stone in that bag. My mum will be pleased. Not long out the oven, so they've just been baked. Could I have a get? Dark, they've been cooked. I have a get sounded good. Divine. I'm going to have a falafel once more. I think that's where we're going to get lunch every day. Come for a coffee, buy your lunch. Just a little thing. But I do think we should have a salad with the pasta. Guinea pig food. This is a bit like a scene from a potential Tarantino remake of The Birds. Okay, here's the deal. I'm walking into the middle of St. Ives Harbour. The sea is out. The sea is out, I'm going to look at that, that boat over there, train? Um, it's because we were talking to Lisa's brother yesterday and he does deep sea diving and he dove down and saw three trains from the First World War that were scuppered during World War I. They fell off a boat. I mean, Nadia's over there getting something for something. Um, but I've just realised I'm a sitting duck. This is like a Mexican standoff, it's just a Cornish standoff. Everywhere I look, there's a seagull surrounding me. And I'm in the middle with two bags of pasties. And the smell is sensational, but everywhere I look, there they are. Day, it's going to be fully underwater. I love that detail. I love it. Basically, I would. You're in the harbour now. I know, I'm actually in it. It's weird, isn't it? It is weird. Um, I'm just desperate to... Ah! What? Oh, yeah, you just... Oh, did you just tread on a spider crab shell? No. You're going to be... It that's wasn't part a shell, of the news. It was a tiny little bit sticking out. They're quite spiky. Oh, oh, oh. Do you know what I keep thinking well, of? At least now we know they're not venomous. Do you know what? Watch this one. Well, Mark. I keep thinking of soft shell crab sushi. Really Every fancy. time I crunch on it, it makes me want sushi. <coughs> nice crab sandwich. So look at this, guys. So this is the harbour wall. I love the POV here. Oh, are you happy? You know what I feel sad about? What? Really what? Because what would be so nice I don't mind them. is every night to just go and get a takeaway from someone and just come and sit on the beach. You can, they've got enough crabs to... No, but what can they take us? Well, I hope you're not thinking the girls are going to be able to eat these on the beach. No, 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 they want to come back to us. Ow. What? A piece of crab in my foot, babe. Hey, put your fucking sandals on. I feel like I'm on a holiday in the UK. It's a bit like they've I've been... I've got loads of shopping. 
and I've got crab in my foot. That's very relaxing. What's that uh, one? Look, look at them. Look. No, no, listen. Babe, oh, put your shoes on. Yeah, but they don't work on this side. Why well, are they going to stop you getting crunched on? Oh. oh my God, you know you can get infected by the spikes. Sorry. So it does make me laugh. We are, we literally, I mean, we've got used to it because we're Brits, I have to say, but it's making me chuckle with laughter. The fact that we are wa essentially walking through a plague of crabs and we accept it. They're everywhere I look, there are carcasses, shells, legs. It's a graveyard, this beach. It's not a beach, it's a graveyard. Where have you been, Mum? I've been to the church, and this you know is what? the church. So, looking at like the cheese onion ones, the cheese and this steak. Is that a nice iron? Iron. And I've got, I, by accident, I've got two bags of cinnamon. Right. And those. Let's have a look. Two point fifty. That. Mother and baby, oh. Barbara Hepburn. Yeah. Wow, is that in the church? No, oh. I couldn't see it. You have to take me in. I've not been in that church. No, exactly. And I've got. And I've lost it now. Um, I'm going to just try them out. I've got what they call, you wouldn't know what they are, they're called Christian cards or something. Christian cards? I've, I've never seen them before, but Liz used to go on about them and there they were. Christian cards? They're sort of... What, oh, what a Christian them. credit card? Well, they're just sort of a little tiny picture of the saint. Saint's card, saint's card, that's it. Oh. Um, okay. I trust you. And you lit some candles. And and they're actual candles, which most ah, places aren't these put money days, in are and they? The light comes on. Yeah, and it's nice to have the actual oh, candles. We'll and, and I did one for mum, one for dad, because oh. I felt bad about not doing one for dad, because I did one for mum, one for Lizzie. Liz, one for Mike, and um, then I did one for dad. Did you do one for dad? Yeah, and oh. then I did one for Jim as well, because oh. I thought, how far back Christ. can I go, though? That's Bloody the hell, trouble. Five. And by then, the whole church was on fire. I'm joking, I'm joking, that's a joke. <laughs> Oh my god! Ah, 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 ah. Is that no! You're gonna have to sit on it. Solve it. No, no, Everything I had a hat for a reason. No, I had a hat this morning. I couldn't uh, sit in Wherever you throw your hat, it's your home, Mum. Yeah, that's yeah. true. Yeah. What? Nothing. Are you going to come down the stairs or are you going to go down the slope and we'll meet you down the other end? Uh, I'll come, I'll try the stairs. Yeah, just try it. Oh my God. Look at the slope on the, it might help your leg. Does it slope the right way or the wrong way? Oh, look, you're looking at you, Mum. There's no stopping you. Quite slopey though, isn't it? It's very slopey. Very slopey. That's why they call it the slope in. <laughs> no. Oh, I love it here. Look at that cloud sort. Yeah. God mum, you look so small. Go on, you can do it. This is an action shot, mum. I'll speed it up. And then as soon as you pass me, I'll slow it down because you're going so fast. Shutter speed can't keep up with you. So there's my legs. There's my mum's legs. We're the ant and deck of YouTube. Look at you. Mum, you've, you've almost got a flick to your hair. <laughs> like an air flick. F Do you like an air, air flick? flick? Is that hello, hello? Yeah. That was a load of old rubbish, wasn't it? They don't seem to be stopping for anything. Mum, look in the mirror, look at the window. Oh. Oh, look at the two <laughs> I'm eating 
between rum and raisin fudge. So I'll show them what you've got. Not a lot. No, hang on, I like it up here. Yeah, this is cute. Oh, Mark, we've got to get Cornish sea salt. I've been in here. So pretty. So sweet. I just want to live here. This is like a. This is like a. It's like walking into a children's program. Don't you think? It's like walking into a children's program. I just want to stay here. Because I think it's just somebody's. No, I just want to live here. Yeah. Well, let's. Oh, yeah, but you say that, but then we get to like, oh, we couldn't, kids. yeah, we couldn't do it. Well, bloody kids. Who did you just bump into them? Well, oh, your mouth's full. Well. Sorry. What happened? Bumped into, Sorry. what do you say? Just shout out to Nikki. Shout out to Nikki. Nikki, who I've just met, who's given me a big hug with her mother, Rose, and Aww. a guy, which who I wasn't introduced to, but uh, um, all lovely, lovely. Where were they? In the shop? Bookshop? No, in this pa in this passageway, in this oh. road. It's very sweet. And she said Mark had given her a shout out recently Aww. and that they love um, the garden, Green Fingered Hell. Aww. And how were we? And Aww. were we too hot? And we'll Give her a shout out. Say Nikki. Nikki! Shout, shout out. Uh, is this a shout out, literally. Shout out. Nikki! <laughs> it's really nice to see you, love. Oh, Funk you... me to death, but really nice to right, see you. It's good to meet you, Mum. Okay. All right, you're heading off. Wipe your mouth off. Yeah, all right, all right. Right. Yeah, all right, take care. Straight on. Straight on and right and then left. And there'll be uh, somebody in the house, won't there? Yeah, they're always there, yeah. <laughs> always there. There's always someone there, Mum. What? Mum? Mum? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I do that sometimes. I wink too hard, I fall over. This pub's called the Kettle and Wink. What does the Kettle and Wink mean? Kettle and Wink. Kettle and Wink. Because this favourite vlogger, so Kiddly Wink, the name refers to a time when alehouses kept smuggled brandy in a kettle to deceive the excellent... Oh, so you'd wink. Regular customer, look at the Kettle and Wink. When he gave his order, it's not hard to see how the town going down to the Kettle and Wink. Ah, Kettle and Wink. Do you remember when I wanted to do a history of Britain through pub names? I, I think it's a perfect idea for YouTube, where you do the, the net, you do the derivation of a pub name and the reason that a local pub's called it. Local history through a pint, through a pub. The highest cash point in the yeah, world. Try and reach it. <laughs> I'm done with it. <laughs> That's the highest cash Did point you? in the world. So we're this is this is what St. Ives is like, look. See, that's why you don't want to be driving into St. Ives. Oh Christ, look at that. It's a bit tight. A bit tight. Sweet strong acid. <laughs> so when the chips are down, what sort of day do you think we've had? Good. We had a good day? Yeah. Have you won? Have I won what? Are you winning? I'm winning. You, you do that, them. you're going to break the fucking bag, babe. Open that bag. Just carry the tankies. I don't want to, they're hot. What do you mean they're hot? Plastic, I don't like it. Oh my God. Don't push it too hard. As the woman <laughs> in the shop said, it'll get you there yeah, and it'll I'm get you back. Babe, babe, be careful. Get your head taken off around this bend. Fucking hell. Coming around like nutters. Anyway, there's a shop up here. So my cup of tea. Come and check this shop out, guys. Look. Needful things. Look. Studio Ghibli anime film memorabilia vintage. What about that is not my cup of tea. I know. Nunu crochet. As soon as I saw this, I was like, Nunu this crochet is crochet over your nun. Nunu. Oh no, Nunu. Look, they got oh, Marmite. Look at the mar oh, is that an egg cup? Star Wars. I love Star that Marmite egg cup. Oh, look at that. Look at this. Masters of the Universe. Look, Dark Crystal. Can you see that in there? The art okay, of the Dark okay. Crystal. Look at all these. Original Stormtroopers. Yeah, it's not original. Oh, 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 look at the, oh, the t-shirts in there. Oh my, oh look. The original top. you've got to come back here. Where are you going? Oh, oh. I don't know, I see a set of stairs now, I'll just go. What is wrong with you? You just head off anyway. Well, this must be where we're going to come up with these steps. Yeah. Oh, I've got such a... Do you know all I've had to eat all day? Dan, you're oh, going to make me feel guilty about my fudge. 
I've got body dysmorphia about my fudge. Guys, subs, you have to give Nanny Di a round of applause. Do it now. <laughs> She's gone up and down to St. Ives twice today. She's oh. done about 10,000, 12,000 steps. Nearly killed me, subs, just now. It's very hot. I'm look sweating, at look at me, I've come up. I thought I was going to have to do a rescue mission for you. Uh, so what are your thoughts on the day, Mum? Um, I'm tired. Have you won? I've won. Is it a winner? I've definitely won. Did you enjoy your coffee? You said you yes. nearly had a heart attack. Yeah, it made me, me um, palpitate. Any reflections on life? Um, I've had many today. Well, I have two, but I'm too tired to. Uh, I want to share them all. Oh, go on, then share them. I think it's all pointless. <laughs> Well, yes, is that. I think, given the fact that J.K. Rowling has been told you're next, we're in a barbaric age. Yeah. An age of barbarism. Yeah. Maybe you need to go and have a packet of crisps or a yoghurt. No, no, just lie down. Lie down. Everything happens oh, for a reason. Oh, look at the sea in the background. Mom, your top is so philosophical. Oh, I know. Doesn't it just... Oh, subs. That was tough. That was so tough. I think you can deservedly eat nothing tonight. Yeah. You've got half a pasty in your room. <laughs> I've got a tiny bit of fudge here. Right. Next time you go on your own, buy me some fudge and keep it safe and then just hand it to me the next time. You a see big me. bag of it. Not a big bag, but this big bag. Oh, okay. It's a deal.